the V Trades technical analysis course is now live. Learn to read the chart the right way to prevent costly mistakes. Click the link below to start training now. What's up traders? This is VTrades and today I'll be doing a technical analysis breakdown for the iShares 20 year treasury bond ETF with the ticker symbol TLT. If you want a chart analysis guarantee to be done, please read the description below. Also take a second to give the video a like and subscribe for more chart analysis. I appreciate it very much. This video is for entertainment purposes only. It does not constitute any financial advice. I will first go over what I see in the daily chart and finish the video off with the weekly chart. So here we have the daily chart for TLT and we did see a rise in looks like price. Looks like I did my analysis on Friday when the price is 106.72. We did see a, a pull push up got rejected and now we're going back down so uh does it look like the uptrend is over for tot and we're going to see continuation to the downside or is this a little pullback where we're going to see another push higher uh, well let's go over the chart to see if we find out what's more likely to occur well obviously there was this big downtrend right here and i can contain it inside of this green channel so there was this downtrend but there was an overshoot uh, that can lead to a break and also it could mark a bottom uh, not all the time but sometimes it does uh, but the break definitely did occur because you can see the massive rally that took place but you can see once the rally found resistance at this previous breakout right here at this 108 uh, found resistance and sold off pretty harshly and now we came back to test it again and we're seeing some resistance uh, once again so it's not looking good for the uh, bulls that we got rejected again it should have pushed through it especially with the momentum that it had so that's not a good sign uh, this channel could be in play right here uh, but we don't really see confirmation on the top side. Uh, we do have three touches on the bottom side, but um, this is looking pretty weak if we cannot make it to the top side. So uh, right now it looks like TOT is going to be pulling back. Looks If it finds some type of support at this EMA, then we could reattempt this 108 level, retest it, because it did find some support right here when it pushed through the EMA. Uh, so prices were trading right at this 99, $100 level. Shot through the EMA, pulled back, found some type of support. Rallied higher, found resistance at the 108. Now we're bouncing back to the EMA. So if it holds, there's a good chance we see another attempt higher. Uh, if it doesn't hold, we're going to be going back down to this trend line right here. And if that fails, uh, then, you know, going back down to the lows. Uh, so right now, TLT is not looking that good. Um, I don't like how we got rejected from this 108 level, but it's not the end of the world. We do have uh, some bullish momentum. You can see there was this uptrend channel right here. And we had the first break of it and prices did go up to retest these highs, which it kind of did. And then we have this little smaller little uptrend right here. So um, this could this uptrend could be played out, uh, but it's a little too early to call. You know, it's just a little too early because we do have this EMA and this possible trend line. Uh, but if neither of them holds, then uh, there's a good chance we make another leg down at the very least. You can see this is the first leg, this is the second leg, and that would take us back to the $98 level. And maybe even back down to the lows. Uh, there was this measure move to the upside right here. This is the first attempt. This was the second attempt. And you can see that if this is the top right here, we came up way short of the measure move. And when you see that, we usually rally very strongly in the opposite direction because it looks very weak for the bulls. So uh, that's another indicator that um, it's not good for the bulls that we, we are not reaching this measure move. It's a little too early to call. Like I said, this could just be a pullback and we could find some, some type of support and rally higher. But as of right now, what I'm seeing on the chart, it's not looking good. It's looking like we could reestablish this downtrend and retest those lows. Uh, so that's everything I see on the daily chart. Basically, uh, since last Friday, we're, we're just a little bit lower. Um, so one week's price action is a little bit lower. Uh, but right now we are approaching some type of support and maybe even this trend line. We'll see if one of them holds and if it holds, then we can see maybe another push higher. So that's everything on the daily chart. Uh, let's take a look at the weekly chart. Now here's the weekly chart for TLT. And you can see how this week's candle is bearish. This is a tail bar, uh, very similar to, um, it's a tail bar known as a reversal bar. Same thing right here, but this one's red. And let's see if we can find another one. Let's see, usually you'll find them at tops. So right here is a good example. So you can see how this bar right here, very similar to the bar that we just got right over here. So it's a tail bar known as a reversal bar. Basically prices trended up, but it closed low. So that's what it means. 
But again, that's just one bar in the grand scheme of things. It uh, doesn't mean a lot. So prices were also in this bigger trend down right here. So this is the larger macro trend. This one definitely fits against the price action pretty good and it is confirmed. Uh, we did see prices come up short here, which will lead to a break on the opposite side, which we did get. Uh, we just made the first attempt lower. We will rally. Now prices are gonna attempt to make the second attempt, second move down. So if this one fails, then we could see another move higher. We'll have to wait and see because it didn't happen already. Uh, but prices will try to make that second attempt down. And right now we're above the EMA, so it's not really that bearish. Uh, but just like in the past, we got above the EMA just by a little bit and we sold off. We're back above there, uh, expecting a pullback to occur. And now if it somehow finds some type of support at those areas I mentioned on the daily chart, then we could see that impulse higher. Now, if it just crashes down, then this is the real deal. And we're going back down to retest these lows. Uh, so it just depends on what TLT reacts to. You know, um, it could do a lot of different things, but um, we have to wait till what to see what it does at given levels. Right now, you know, we could just make a two legged pullback and get another impulse higher. Or this is the real deal where we see this is the top and the market does not want to correct anymore. And we could just roll over back down to the lows. We'll have to wait and see. Uh, me personally, uh, what do I think can occur? If I were to take an estimate or a guess, uh, my prediction would be, I think we're gonna definitely see that pullback occur, uh, at least um, in the short term. And again, if if we break that EMA and that trend line, I think we're going back down to the lows um, by a good amount. So uh, that's all I have for TLT on the daily and weekly chart. Right now, you know, it's not really looking that bullish. This was supposed to be a strong reversal but we're finding resistance once again basically it's a double top uh, see this is the first high this is the second high a double top and that could lead to lower prices also so uh, not looking good for TLT but uh, we'll mo know more information uh, next Saturday thank you for stopping by and checking out my video make sure to check out the rest of the channel since you might be surprised at what you can learn leave a comment down below on where you think prices are headed also share the video if you want your friends to learn about the markets Lastly, I appreciate any feedback to help improve the channel since I want to deliver great content to you guys. See you next time and bye.